world, anything is possible. Ooh. And here you are, just starting out on a creative adventure. Infinite worlds ahead. Infinite possibility. And one goal, to become a master builder. Ooh. See how these magicians of the brick use their creative tools. Summoning creatures. Conjuring houses. Flattening mountains. And shaping the land itself. <laughs> you too can wield that power. Whoa, that looks awesome. Master the creative tools. Collect new bricks, models, and vehicles. Conquer worlds. Make your mark and become a master builder. I want to be a master builder. To create completely new worlds of endless possibility. Welcome to Lego World. Hey, what's up, guys, and welcome to Lego Worlds. This game has been in early access on Steam for almost two years now. It's finally out on Steam and Xbox One and PS4. I'm playing it here on Steam, but I plan on eventually playing some on the PlayStation 4 as well. I don't currently have it on the PS4 because I have it being shipped to me and the shipment was late. I'm super sorry about that, but for right now, I'm going to be playing it on the PC. I'm so excited for this game to be playing through it for you guys. Of course, it's huge. It's like Minecraft if you haven't seen my original early access series on it. So we're going to be starting from the very beginning and having so much fun. I hope you enjoy the series. And of course, if you do, make sure you give this video a like, share with your friends and family, and of course, comment in the comment section below. But we'll worry about that at the end of the video. For right now, let's go ahead and start playing some LEGO Worlds. Whoa, what's happening? Whoa, we're a spaceman. And we're in space. What is, oh no, that's a meteor. That's probably not a good idea. Oh gosh, that almost took us out. Oh no, our ship. Uh-oh, this is gonna be like that movie, but just a Lego version. We're stuck in space. Oh look, there's a planet. I hope we can land on that. Oh Jesus, no, there's a tractor. No, the chickens. No! Save the chicken, spaceman! No! Why does it have to start in tragedy? This is awful. Bye bye, chickens. Bye, space. Oh, the farmer got one. Oh, gosh. Whoa. Get a parachute? Do you have a parachute at all? I guess he doesn't. Oh, hold tab. Um, shurn. Oh, I can choose my character. Oh, and I can choose, okay, so my interactive girl or an astronaut, I'm of course an astronaut. Um, oh, and we can just change it, like if we don't feel like playing as a, um, what's it called? A, um, why aren't these loading? Uh, here, no hat. Uh, weird. Some of these are loading, some of these are not. So we can just go in the full and astronaut costume. You can see there's like several different costumes. There's also gonna be DLC coming to this game. I know in the PS4 version, there's like a spy setup going on. All right, I'm, I'm happy with this. Can I like get out? Except, there we go. Um, so yeah, let me know if you guys would like to see like costume showcases in this game, but whoa, look at us. We're landing on a pirate area, a, pilot, a pirate island. Oh, and is that our ship? Ooh, that's our ship. Pirate this game looks amazing. Playground. Ooh. Your first Lego world. So much to discover, but your rocket took a beating. A few gold bricks should fix it right up. Ooh, so there's Lego bricks in the game now. Like I said, I played this game when it was basically in early beta, and it was so much different than it currently is now. There's like actually objectives and things to do now, which is so cool. Oh my gosh, that means we can actually like play through. Whoa, what is that? Another meteor. Um. <laughs> A meteorite. Hi, meteorite. My name's Zebra, the astronaut. Oh, does that have her weapon? Oh, it does. Look at this. Yeah. We got the discovery tool. Okay, so where is that going to be? Unlocked. Discovery tool. Right here. The discovery tool. Use the powerful discovery tool to scan and collect new models, outfits, creatures, and vehicles. Once they're in your collection, you can use the tool to summon things into your worlds. 
Place them precisely where you want them. Or fire them into the sky with wild abandon. <laughs> Getting to grips with the discovery tool is the first step on your journey to become a master builder. A master builder. I should have done the voice acting for this game, except it would have been worse. So it's glad that I'm not. <laughs> so we can, how do I do that? Wow, there are so many controls on the bottom of the screen, but there's like light beams coming out. Is that gonna be golden bricks? I think so. So let's see, I, I can move around, I can jump, I can action items. Um, hmm. So let me go ahead and pull up our discovery tool here. And I can look at my discoveries, no discoveries just made, so I can, hold on, did I just discover? I discovered the seagull! New discovery type unlocked. Nice. Creatures. So now that I've discovered it, I can actually purchase it, and that way I can use a seagull in my own world. It's awesome. So they've changed that up a little bit. There we go, I just purchased a seagull, so I can spawn in a seagull at any point in time whenever I want. And as many as I want. So I can go ahead and go back and boom, 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 boom. And just spawn in a bunch of them. Um, with that being said, I'm gonna go ahead and not worry about it. Wow, there's a lot of stuff going on. Um, get out of here. Menu's a little weird to work on. And there are really different levels. So we are on like the first section of a level here. Return to the rocket. Okay then, and travel to other worlds. Wow. All right then, so we're gonna go ahead and place this and not have to worry about it anymore. How do I see? Put away. There we go, so I can go ahead and tap again, make, do this and start making other discoveries though, like this tree right here that was glass, grass New clump five. Discovery type unlocked. And there is, objects. ooh, objects, cool. And then I can, can I discover this or that? What is it, discover? That is grass clump two. <laughs> I like it. Okay then, so what about like my ship here? Can I like discover anything like that? But it's great though, because it can, you know, make sure I um you know keep up with discovering things, try to find a bunch of new stuff. Alright, so let's go ahead and back out of here and I'm gonna put away my v my weapon here and, and let's go to some of these like golden little light beams and see what's here. Like this is like I guess this is an old abandoned ship. Hello! Whoa, look at you! You have a golden brick! Captain wants a pirate clock tower, but I can't open the chest to get the plans. Can you help? Absolutely. Wow, look at this. Okay, then, so let's go ahead and try to make a um clock tower. Apparently, I need to do something, so let me go ahead and press tab and get this and figure this out really quickly. Um, First off, let's discover this. It's something. Um, Can I... I can unlock it or I can remove it. Oh, I can remove these things. All right, so I can get these out of the way just like that. There's a skeleton, here we go. Discover. <laughs> I love it, that's actually really cool. So let me go ahead, I'm trying to like get used to these controls still. Um, let's go ahead and open up this chest. Can I just, oh, I don't punch it, I actually open it up like this. What's going to be inside? It's gonna be! Hey, look at that, we got a plan for something. The pirate clock tower plan. New discovery type unlocked. Very Brick cool. Build. So we got new brick build, and they didn't have many of these when I played. We got the pirate clock tower. Awesome. So let's do whatever we can do with that. Um, let me go ahead and yeah, let's press tab. Here. Ooh. Get this out, and then build a pirate clock tower wherever we can. Um, let's do one. Where where would it look nice? You me can I zoom out a little bit? Uh, let's put one right here. There we go. There is a pirate clock tower. All right, we get ourselves our first ever golden brick. That is so rad. I am loving this game. Current rank, we are one. Learn a builder, gold bricks to next rank. That's okay then. Very, very cool. The first golden step on the road to becoming a master builder. But you'll need two more gold bricks to fix your rocket. Okay. I'll go ahead and do that. Let me punch a sandcastle. Probably shouldn't have done that because I could have actually discovered it. So let's discover the, oh, there's a pig. Discover the pig. Oh, 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 discover you. You have been discovered, pig. I'm gonna ride you now. Q. Hey, hey, look at that. I'm riding the pig. I'm surfing a pig, actually. Dun, 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 surfing a pig. <laughs> awesome, I actually got a, yeah, I'm an achievement for that. So what is this? This is like a little farm. So I can go ahead and get the pig in here. There you go, I gotta put a pig in here. No, he left again. Hello, pirate, what do you want? Some pigs and chickens is what I need right here, Savvy. Uh, so you need three more. Okay, so what is this asking for? Oh, I can spawn them in. I don't even have to find them in the you know in the world. So I can go ahead and purchase Yoon. 
and I can go ahead and place and place. This is awesome. There's actual quests going on now. My phone alarm is going off because I always happen to record at 3 p.m. Um, no, these are seagulls. Oh, oh, you know what? Yeah, that's sort of, sort of the wrong bird. Um, let's go ahead and put this away. And let me find a chicken because the chickens rained down from the heavens earlier. I hear a chicken. Do not see a chicken. Chicken, is that you two? Oh, is it, is it you? Chicken, ready, discover. All right, so buy that and then place one. Wait, wait, oh, no, I, what, what? Resume, back, place, 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 place. All right, we did it, awesome. And you gave me a gold brick for it, yes. Thank you. So there's another one done. We get a bunch of studs for that as well. So the studs are super important in this game so that we can actually continue on and um become a master builder. Whoa. And Two actually buy stuff. Three. Just one more and you can lift off to another world. All right. Now let me plop back down here. Oof. Just like that. And let's see what else we can do. This is so much fun. This is really like like different. Wait, can I ride on you, Seagull? That'd be so cool if I can run on the seagulls, but they fly right, way too fast, so I don't know if I can. Can do like a little dodge roll. Ooh, and there's a chest down here. Uh, Let's go ahead and open this Discover you, And then here, you are not a discoverable, you're just a chest that should have studs in you. This is so much different from the original, you know, beta we played. It's so cool. Okay. Hmm. What else is going on down here, huh? Uh, well, there is more stuff to, you know, discover, so let's go ahead and discover. Everything that, like, sort of seems to glow, I think I can discover, so, I, like, I saw you here. The sand castle, maybe, discover. That's so cool how you can do that. We can get, like, a discover, you know, spree going on where we're just discovering everything I can. I mean, before, in the old game, how it used to work is you had to just simply hit things, so I'm glad that's, like, a little more intuitive, not, you know, so point blank. It's like the game's more of a game. Hello, I need a pirate throne to make this ship feel like home, me matey. Oh, I didn't mean to punch you in the face. <laughs> Nothing to, you know, says home more like being punched in the face. You need a pirate throne. Where am I gonna find you a pirate throne, dude? Maybe I can find another uh, thing somewhere around here? Cause I don't know. Uh, Pirate throne, well what's up here? There has to be something up here. Look at us go, this is awesome. Ooh, there is a chest up here. There's three chests in here. I think we found the pirate loot. Whole bunch of studs. There's, oh, there's a plank up here too. You can walk off the, the super high plank. And then one more. Awesome, so we're getting a bunch of studs there. And here's a question for you guys. Those of you who are playing along or might be you know playing for yourself, let me know. Are you getting the same area? Is it still randomly generated? I would love to know. Like, I think this game for the most part is randomly generated, but. So where, is there some in here maybe? Like it looks like there's something glowy in here. That has to be something cool. There is another chest full of booty. There we go. So he wants a pirate throne. How am I going to make him one? Um, Maybe I could, um, pirate captain cannot discover yet quest available. Um, Huh, I can't, uh, the clock tower wouldn't be a throne. Then what do I do about this guy? Let's look, is there any more parts of the ship I can explore? Here's another chest on this side as well, but I don't see any way to give him a throne. How do I give him a throne? I don't understand this, this is a little weird. Like everything else has been pretty well explained to me, so maybe there's somewhere else on the map I can find ourselves a pirate throne. Ooh, what did I find? I think I found myself a pirate throne. Okay, cool, so I think this is what we need. Um, so let's go ahead and, what button do I need to press? I always forget the buttons like really quickly. Discover the pirate throne. Can I discover anything else here? Because if I can, I'll go ahead and discover it. Um, it's probably this fire, right? Nope, what? Oh, did I just buy the fire? I guess I did. Um, and then the torches, that little log, I don't know if I can discover it. Doesn't look like I can. Doesn't look like, all right then. Well, very cool, let's go ahead and go back. And I'm gonna go ahead and give him his pirate throne. I wonder if I could like do it from here. <laughs> I don't know if I can snipe it out or not, so let's not mess it up. Let me go ahead, run on over there and, and spawn in our pirate throne for Mr. Pirate himself. That'll be pretty fun. This is so awesome so far though. Like I was thought I thought it would still be like Minecraft like it originally was, where it was sort of an adventure game with no like set mode. It was just, you know, you run around and do whatever you want, but it's actually much more advanced than that, and it's a blast so far. So let's go ahead and buy that and give him himself a pirate throne. Um 
or, or not. Uh, how about here? No, not good enough for you, buddy. How many power thrones do you want, man? There we go, okay. I reloaded the level and I talked to him again and it worked. Don't know what was with that, but okay, I will take it. Okay, current rank, learner, builder, gold bricks to next rank, none. There we go, we are done with level one and moving on to level two. Yeah. Discoverer builder. Nice, we are a discoverer builder and we need to get six more until we're level three. Okay, that's gonna be a long way to go though. If the three gold bricks. That's exactly what your rocket needs. Congratulations. All right. So we got three gold bricks, which means I don't know why it changed my character. Like I was playing as the astronaut very happily. I was just like, yo, you, you gotta try out the you know, the, 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 uh, the space lady. I'll try the space lady out maybe next episode. Every episode I'll try to be a new character. How's that sound? Right now though, let's go ahead and you know do something here. Three gold bricks, there's one, there's two, and there's three. Order up, how do you like that, buddy? <laughs> hey, he's happy about it. What does that say, the pug Z? Okay, pug, pug zebra, I'll take it. Is there a toilet in there? There's totally a toilet in there. What, I can't go in? Oh, I'm pressing the wrong button. There we go. Is it, wait, is this an, a spaceship the or an excavator? shows you the worlds you have been to, the world you're on, and the worlds you're yet to explore. Collect more gold bricks, and you'll be able to travel farther afield to bigger worlds with more biomes and a huge variety of new discoveries. Wow, okay then. So let's go ahead and move to our next level, I guess. I mean, we're right here. This is where we just were. Um, I can go to the find a world locked or create a world. Um, is this what I wanna do? View map. This is where I just was. I need 10 bricks right there to get there. And I don't have 10 bricks, I only have three. Let's resume then. Interesting, so I still have more I can do here then? Oh, keep that in mind. Oh, it's nighttime now. That's sort of very disorienting when the stars move that quickly. What's go? Oh no, no, the skeletons have returned, run! Oh gosh, oh gosh, what's going on here? Um, sit on the throne. I am the Pirate King. I sit here and, and that's really it, really. That's all I do. Was there, was there something that was supposed to happen here? He's sitting in the fire. Oh, oh, that gave me money. <laughs> okay, I'll take it. Yeah, why is it all green here? I don't know, something's really weird happening. Okay, uh, okay, the pirates are mad at me. Beat up the pirate, not the pirates, but the, I guess they're undead pirates or something. Yeah, beat you up, beat you up too. There's a green dot here on the map, like there's something, you know, to be noted. Let's see, can I like zoom in? I can zoom in, but the, you know, not too much of a use for it. I can't really see too much going on there. Come on, beat you up, beat you up, beat you up, beat you up. I'm on my last bit of health here, so I gotta be careful. Come on, no! Oh boy, I almost got him though, I almost got him. No, there's just more spawning in, I think. What do we do here then? I'm not sure. So unfortunately the game seems to be a tad bit buggy right now. It is the first day of launch. I actually started a brand new save file because that other one, I just didn't know what to do. It wasn't popping up, but I made a new save file and now that same issue I was getting with where I was trying to throw in the throne and it just wasn't working. Now it's not happening with the throne, but it's also not happening with the clock tower either. So it seems like even when I make a brand new save file, there's some kind of weird glitch going on where things aren't activating the way they should be. So um, episode two, of course, I'll be back. It'll be continuing on, but this will be a short episode showing off LEGO Worlds to see if you guys are interested in it, and if so, of course, expect a full bound series on it, showing off the game, and of course, enjoying it as much as possible. I find it weird that it's telling me I can discover, like it was blinking like I can discover this thing of I place down, like what is that supposed to mean? I can discover you, what are you? I guess I the pirate clock. Interesting, so you can make discoveries within discoveries. Weird. But yeah, with that being said, I hope you enjoyed. If you did, make sure to give this video a like, share with your friends and family, and of course, comment in the comment section below. If you watch this point of the video, make sure you comment Zebra World, so I know you've watched the video, and that you are a Zebra-tastic viewer. By the other way, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.